you know with filming or with content creation if i can say once you start recording you don't want to stop but it's hard to start recording i have been contemplating uh recording a video there's a video that i want to record but i've been contemplating and i think it's not yet time for me to record it because i do want to record it but something in me i'm i i i, I usually go with my intuition and something in me just doesn't i don't have the energy for it i have the ideas but i don't have the energy for it but yeah, since now i just uh finished recording the video about peak time peak hiring time uh i thought why not do this one so this one is for those who have made it now who are preparing to go and start their new life abroad be it you are going abroad for the first time if you are going abroad for the first time congratulations a huge congratulations and uh, there's a lot in store for you uh be prepared for your mind to be broadened for your perspective to be broadened to uh learn new things be prepared to step into uh new and bigger horizons you know and uh, be prepared for 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 greater things and if you are moving abroad for the second time third time uh, i'm sure your first uh experience has taught you much and the purpose of this video is just to encourage or to encourage no to give tips rather uh, to those who are moving abroad i just want to say that uh, it's nice gumnandi ukhlala emazoni and uh, number two it's got its packs way too and those packs uh so there are challenges and also there are benefits of living abroad come with an open mind and uh, psych yourself uh for self-development psych yourself for self-discovery why because you are going you are high likely going to spend most of the time alone uh those who are here in taiwan they know that usually it's one foreigner in a county or one foreigner in a in a district you know if you are lucky you'd be two uh but yeah so be prepared for self-discovery be prepared for uh for, for 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 growth for development uh be prepared for your perspective to be changed be prepared uh for learning and unlearning you know and i just want to say that i just want to give you three tips that will make your stay or living abroad a bit easier number one have a support system or have a support structure uh reach out to people on facebook online find the, the the social network that is popular in that country uh for here in south africa we use whatsapp here we use line in vietnam they use zalo and different countries have got their own famous social networks so find groups for experts people from your country because you really need to connect 
with people from your country so that uh, they can support you in navigating your life in a new country how uh, you can ask question about sending money home about maybe let's take uh, let's say you want to do something maybe an affidavit or you want um criminal record check now that you are in a new country you know those the people can uh, support you and answer questions that you might have while you are still figuring things out in the new country and number two in you finding uh, or building a support network uh find your tribe find people that you relate with people you have similar values people you have similar interest because uh, we are coming to these countries with different goals and we are driven by different things maybe you came here uh, to make money or you just came here because you needed uh, a new thing your life was uh, boring you just needed a new experience maybe you came abroad because uh, you just needed a break there, uh, there are many things that are happening back home and you just needed a break so you come here for different reasons and when you come here you will find different people who are into different things who are who have got uh, different lifestyles so find those that fit your preference so that um, you avoid finding yourself in a space where that will make you maybe spend more whereas uh, your goal is to save money or find yourself in a space where you are now doing things that you intended not to do such as maybe drinking every weekend or all that you know there are all types of people i can guarantee you that you will find your tribe and uh, number three what would be my number three take your job serious take your job serious and bring value to your school let them know something about you let them uh when they think of an idea they know that okay you know what judy can execute this very well or judy can have more ideas when it comes to this now i've introduced uh south african cuisine to my school and they are so into it now i have three cook classes that are coming one is on the two are on the 27th and one is on the 3rd of june i am going to teach them a dish south african dish um they're buying the ingredients and everything so bring value let leave history leave a mark when you leave that school let them remember something about you when i came to the school most people they did not know much about south africa except those who has uh, who have done history and they only know about mandela you know and now most people they know about South Africa now they they are interested they know chakalaka and they know Roy Bosti you know so make sure that you leave a mark Uguti you leave a signature Uguti Judy was here Tembi was here John was here you know <coughs> so yeah and another thing keep communication with people back home you don't want to find yourself in a situation where now when you go back home it's like hey you know when people talk about reverse reverse culture shock and 
things they had to learn to adjust because now they've been away and they lost connection and they've not kept up with what has been happening back home now when you are back you feel lost and all that you don't want to find yourself in a situation like that and also your people you know distance shouldn't be a factor in keeping up with communication and all that okay i feel like <laughs> this video is not properly planned but yeah we too sometimes if you have time you find yourself in this situation where you want to talk but you have not properly planned but i hope you get something out of this video let me go and make noodles i'm craving noodles i had dinner already but i'm going to have noodles you see why i'm gaining weight but i'm not complaining Goodbye.